Hello, everyone. This is Direwolf20. This is Bahamar, who's hey, really, high up. really high up. Why are you so high up? I'm starting a mob spawner. Oh, all the way up there? Well, it's got a drop, right? I guess. If you wanted to. Don't we want it to drop? How's it going, Bahamar? I'm scared, because I'm really high. Yeah, I, I can see that. But that's you look pretty high up there. Cool. And I'm also playing so, Are we out of charcoal, or am I, like, out of my mind? We may be out of charcoal. Darn it. I'm gonna have to, like, cut down trees and stuff. I'm tired of cutting down trees. Can we automate that yet? Um, yes. Correct. That is correct. We can automate that. Pymar, good answer. Well done. You get an A+. I can't help but feel like you're patronizing me. No. No. It's just Sorry, because I just explained to you like a minute ago. Bad. I think we're ready. I think we're ready, Pahamar. Automate trees. Oh. Like, you're yeah. doing it right now. Doing... Uh, well, I can probably maybe do it right now, but I'm going to need a few more things. Um, and we should also come up with an area to do it at. Like, I'm thinking we should build an area to have a farm. We should be able to automate trees and farms all in one go, but... I kind of have to do a little bit of testing to be sure that we can automate the harvest craft stuff as easily as I think we can. I think MFR can handle harvest craft. Ah, what's hitting me? Something's hitting me, and I don't know what. Is that you? Maybe. Did you just hit me? Maybe. Well, I see a ghast flying up around in the sky. I was wondering if it was that. Don't hit me, dude. Well, someone reminded well, me someone that died. not long ago you killed me, so... What? When? When did I kill you? Frying pan of death. Oh, you mean when you walked into the frying pan? Yeah, that's right. That happened. <sighs> hey, Mr. Uh, flies around everywhere. Come cut down this really tall tree for me. You can fly around too, you know. I... no. I have a really, really tall tree to cut down right now. I was hoping I wouldn't run into one of these stupid, crazy tall trees until I had the thing up that I need. Well, at least my axe is better now. Uh, so yeah, Pahamar, let's take a look real quick. I'm going to cut this down in a minute off camera because this is going to take a long time. Um, let me just get a little bit more charcoal real quick cooked up. Um, so if we look at the requirements to get a harvester, I think we have what we need. So the uh, MFR Harvester requires an Invar Axe, a couple of shears, a couple of plastic sheets, and some gold, and a redstone reception coil. That all is easy, because we have plastic now, right, from mm -hmm. the mine factory mm -hmm. loaded. Raw plastic can be cooked in a smeltery with those raw rubbers that we got. So the only thing left is a machine frame, which is going to require some Invar, some Electrum, some glass, and a PRC 11 XLX 100 logic expansion board thingy, which is redstone, plastic, and a printed circuit board, which requires an unassembled PCB, some transistors, and some capacitors. So the good news is that I think we found somewhere, we found some unassembled PCBs in the, in the city. That's correct. That's correct. So all we need now are capacitors and transistors, which I, off camera between last episode and this one, um, set up for our um, little crazy uh, pressure chamber to make for us. And it's surprisingly not difficult to do. Um, all I need is some plastic, which I just cooked up, from lightning and squid plant seeds, which I've been bone mealing. And we need some compressed iron. So I'm going to make... I'm going to need this many. And one, two, three, you say that four. I imagine you say that like I at home recording and you actually hold up your hand like you're counting. Uh, that may be the case. So I don't want the plastic to be pulled out. So I put another pressure chamber interface on the front of our pressure chamber. And I'm changing the item name begins with plastic to be plastic XX. So then we put um, one, two, one, two four and four, and this should all come together to make uh, the transistor, 
which is plastic, compressed iron, and redstone, and the capacitor, plastic, compressed iron, and redstone. So if I did this right, uh, there's a spider trying to get through the wall at me. Go away. Yeah, they'll, do that. yeah, they'll do that. They're evil, is what they'll do. No, 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 no. Dude, it's scary. I'm afraid of this place and where oh, we're at. No. Um, by the way, I sounds, really... I know, Pahimar. Pahimar, so patronizing. So, like, in theory, we should have just gotten the transistors and stuff that we need. But I don't see them coming out yet, so I have to figure out why not. Oh, you know what? It's probably because I don't have enough... Yeah, they need a little bit higher pressure in there. Let's see. Yeah, they need to be a pressure chamber of one, and we probably don't have that much pressure in there. I forgot. That's why I was cooking up the charcoal. So you get to work. And where's my speed upgrades that I temporarily put in there? You run faster now. Build up that pressure chamber. So once this guy gets to a pressure chamber of one, things should cook up for us. Or at least maybe close. We'll see. Oh, redstone's still going in. Okay. Man, this tower's tall. All right, cool. Man, this tower's tall. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, so there we go. You can see that it's now got, it's not enough pressure, but once we hit one, we should be cool. Oh, you're cooking up more charcoal for me? Thank you. You know, you're a good friend, Pahimar. Totally good job. Now cut down that tree. I'm seriously, dude. What? <laughs> I'm chiseling up here. Oh, what are you making? Mob spawner. Weren't, weren't you here just a few moments ago? Okay. Oh, right. Why, why do you need chisel for a mob spawner? Because it's pretty. Oh, okay, that's fair enough. So this pressure chamber should almost be at the pressure I need. Let's look. There we go, one bar. And this thing should do it. Come on. There we go. I think that means it finished. You guys going to give me what I want? Eep! Hooray! Sister! Oh, thank God for this thing. What? The water totally dropped me. Oh, really? And I couldn't get it back into the stream in time, so I popped the hang glider to stop my fall damage. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, dude, so I've now got the thing I need to make this. So, where's all the rubber that you got from? There it is. Cool. Oh, wow, what's all this stuff? Hardened leather gear? Sweet. Yeah, that's the thing I got from the Quest Reward. I'm just taking it off because it's eating up a lot of my water. It's making me gotcha. hot. Gotcha. It's making me hot. Yes. Yes, armor does that. So, I want to just smelt this stuff. Oh, speaking of being hot, I'm out of water. I have come up, by the way, Pahimar, with a plan to automatically refill our camel packs. Oh, nice. Yeah, it'll 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 be a little while until we get to that point that we can do that, but we should eventually be able to automate that. And I'm not going to reveal the secret until we get there. Haha. -ha. So now I've got transistors and capacitors. Gets me a printed circuit board. Um. Let's grab one. Some more for me. So we've got rubber bars coming. People will probably have noticed that this mob spawner looks exactly the same as every other one I've done. Really? You're going to get yelled at. Yeah, but now I'm doing it with chisel. Oh, well, in that case, all is forgiven. Furnaces are slow. Sink. Let's just check. Harvester, while I'm waiting for that, I can make some invar. Too hard to make. I think I can do it, actually. And we might already have some. We do. Invar and Electrum. Beautiful. All right, so some shears. So I'm going to need four of you. All 
What else am I going to need? Gold. Some redstone. So let's get this. So we've got that piece. Two shears. Invar. Axe. And then that's all that for that. And then I need four more Invar. Great. Do we have any nickel in here? We should, I would think, have nickel. If we don't, it would be down here. Are we not getting nickel? We might not. I'm going to have to investigate that. That doesn't sound right to me. Oh, we've got six in bar. Right. It might have already been mixed into the iron that we were having. So that's cool. And then the electrum. And then I just need some raw plastic. All right. So that should be... Oh, boy. I need glass. No, I have glass. What don't I have? This may not be shift clickable. I wonder what's more entertaining for the viewers, watching you craft something or watch me build this thing? Probably watching you build that thing. I have our very first machine frame from Thermal Expansion. I want you to be aware of that right now. I have a pretty cool looking uh setup so far yeah chisel's nice isn't it mm -hmm. yeah i i really like chisel i think it looks good what i like most about chisel is they don't make it hard to get those blocks like rarely will i use fancy blocks because there's usually like 18 steps to get them but with chisel it's like no it's really easy here you go have fun I think Equivalent Exchange did that once, and everyone just called it OP. Wah, wah. Yeah, you of all people have great sympathy for not being OP. For not being OP. Yeah, no, I'm, I, I consider OP to be fun sometimes. Dude, you've made your YouTube hey, career Pahimar, off of guess what we have. Off OP. Guess what we have, Pahimar? Um, tickets to the Super Bowl. Yes. How did you guess? Magic. Wow, you are the smartest person I know. I uh, I think there's some sarcasm there. <gasps> no, no sarcasm ever. Not on Pahimar. I don't think I ever set this guy to accept. No, he's accepting power from the bottom. I just guess we never put enough power into him. Oh, um, that reminds me. Something someone pointed out in the YouTube comments. Yeah. Uh, we need to move our survivalist generators out of the spaceship because they produce a stupid amount of heat. Well, we don't really go into the spaceship anymore. Except when we do. But, Except when we do. Well, you're correct in that they produce a lot of heat, but we don't really go in there anymore, so I'm not sure how upset I am about them producing lots of heat. You dig? Uh, I'm, uh, I'm, you know, skyblocks, but I guess I could dig. Good. Pahimar jokes. I'm glad YouTube gets my humor. Oh, there we go. It's because these aren't set to accept power. There you go. Now it's taking power. All right, that's better. Okay, we'll ignore redstone. Power comes in. Uh, we're proven now. That's better. So uh, I think I can cut down trees automatically now, Pahimar. Nice. I should Scary make one. Jump of faith. Um, precision sledgehammer just needs three plastic sheets. I can manage that pretty easily. Plastic sheets are relatively cheap. Check it out, dude. You ready? Born ready. 
wow, that was that was some epic first time placement. Thank you. Don't you need to power it? I'm getting there. Oh, and I said it to sheer leaves as well. <laughs> nice. How good is that, dude, huh? It's pretty good. Now you just need something to constantly replant. Well, I'll get a planter next. But I figured before I set up a planter, I should do something that, you know, build an area for it. Like, I don't want to do it right here in the middle of our thing. I'm thinking we we knock over this wall or, or build an area outside this wall with a, a doorway in between. And then we move all of our plants, like these plants and um, everything else over there. I feel like that is work that you're going to have me do. I feel like you're probably right. Oh, by the way, I set up a dropper with the squid seeds, because squid seeds are surprisingly hard to drop into water. So, item dropper from open blocks. Press button, oh, nice. get seed. Oh, right. Let me yeah, ask, right? it's uh, a little challenging because there's a randomness factor. Well, they drop in, like, an order or something. Like, they, they, they kind of drop with a little bit of... An angular block. Oh, that's an awesome. Yeah, and then what happens is they, like bounce out of the water basically makes sense oh, that's a beautiful thing yeah well i'm making something pretty cool too i don't even need to automate this this is automatic enough for me now i'm happy <laughs> that's so cool stop having fun stop having... i'm sorry i won't let it happen again the only thing i want to check though is will it drain power when it's not actually cutting things down that's like the only thing I need to know at this minute. And the answer is no. That's good to know. So we'll definitely want some more power gen too while we're at this. When I, I do don't know if we want to turn monitor, our sludge. Did I make it a two drop or a three drop into the water? I don't know. You're asking me? Yeah, that was my first mistake. Yeah, that's pretty silly. The sludge you put into like that thing, and then you can get different types of blocks out of. Think we should do that? I I feel like we probably should. The the sludge boiler thing. Um, we got another rack out of it, I recall. Yeah, the only thing is it requires a machine frame, and that, there's so many machine frame things that I'd rather have than sludge boiler right now. Ah. All right, so uh, that's done. Uh, we'll get a planter up next, and then I can start planting things in a little bit. Um, but I don't want to do that just yet. I'd rather... I wonder if there's any quests in our book right now that we're close to being able to do, Pahamar. What do you think? Worth a look. We have a quest with unclaimed rewards, apparently. Oh, it's the... Uh, oh, yeah, the end of the beginning. Oh? You needed to make a printed circuit board and plastic sheets. And plastic. So we're both going so to get 16 iron dust. That's a stack of iron. Okay. And we I say we should pick plants. the slime plant seeds. Do we want... Well, because we can bone meal those and get more, right? Yes. Yeah, but everything But the other option is... is rubber tree seeds, which we're fine on, and redstone, which we're really fine on. Okay. Right? I took it. Ramping up. Let's see. React, reactant, dynamo, and a grinder. And then there's ender generator, which uh, I'm going to suspect is really hard. Let's see. Getting chilly. Getting... Maybe you notice it's more than a little bit warm on this planet. Wow. Provide me with enough power yeah, and water, and I can provide you a way to chill water to beat the heat. Snow. We didn't happen to find any ender lilies by chance, did we? Not to my knowledge. That's unfortunate. Alright, you want to come back in a minute, Pahimar, once we have uh, some stuff done and ready to go? Sounds good. Okay, see you guys then. Okay. Oh, Pahamar, did you see that quest that was related to cooling off? I did. 
Did you know we were given a leadstone flux capacitor like early on? I did. So all we need is four water bottles. That shouldn't be too hard to get. Which I'm getting right now. Okay. Ouch. Ow. Oh boy. Oh wow. I oh, are dead. Wow. What? How, how did they all get in there? Because you have a tree you haven't finished cutting down. Oh. Is it safe for me to come out? Yeah, it is. Did you reinitiate your uh, sync clone? I did, but it's going to be a minute. Let me guess. You want me to go cut down that tree? If you can. I need some water first. Okay. I think I have to relog, so I'll be back in a minute. Okay. All right, I am back. So, back. like I was saying, I think we should be able to get some stuff now. Well, here's four water bottles. I already got some, so oh, I should be well, able to hand that well, in. Well. I'm going to, like, stay inside where it's safe for a few minutes, just because, um, you know, dying right now would be really bad for me. We should we should look into making some sink stone storage storage stuff in a bit. I don't know how hard that is to make, but getting chili, manual submit, same reward. We've got some snow and some iron now. Uh, so let's see what Iceberg has to say. Chillin. A snowball and a water bottle will give you cold water. Useful if you get overheated. Glacial precipitator is what we have to make, and that'll give us a spawn high golem. What's that? I'm honestly not terribly sure. It's a Minecraft. Well, I guess they're all Minecraft things, aren't they? I don't know. I'm not really sure. That sounds like something one of us should test. Probably. Uh... Glacial precipitator, not the easiest thing in the world to make, by the way. We need a machine frame, which I really don't want to waste the resources on. So unless high golem is like an awesome thing to get right now, I don't feel like we should do it. Uh, ramping up, reactant dynamo and grinder. One grinder will provide enough mob essence and gunpowder for two, possibly three reactant dynamos. Keep an eye on your power and add more if you need to. Uh, we need a stable power source, and I believe the reactant dynamo provides a perfect solution. Build a dark place, trap those monsters that roam the night, feed them into the grinder, and pipe the results into the dynamo. Should be enough to run quite a few machines, I think. Oh, so your your mob farm actually will be ideal for this, but it, it wants me to make a grinder, unfortunately. That's fine. Okay. Dude, I've already started this. Don't I'm actually, I'm, like, I'm not tearing it down. Well, no, you don't have to tear it down. Like, I think it's good that you're building it, but they want me to make like an MFR grinder, um, and we'll get some, we'll get conveyor belts out of it and gunpowder. But the reactant dynamo, I think, actually runs on gunpowder, if I remember correctly. There's a couple things it can run on. Uh, we're gonna need a PRC, and we're gonna need a bunch of bronze, Tinker's alloy gun. So basically, bronze. Bronze, 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 and a little bit of silver. I can make this probably right now, but the grinder. It's going to be harder. Do we need another trip to the city? Uh, no. We have leather, right? And we have sugar cane, so we can make books. Uh, yeah, the, we just need a little bit more leather you can also make from rotten flesh. Yeah. Like, we have a very limited supply of unassembled PCBs, so I'm hesitant. Like, we're going to need... We're basically going to need two... Thing is, though, is the grinder will help. Like, we won't have to worry about power then. Right, but we could just make the reactant dynamo and get the gunpowder from your mob drop. Well, let's not think too much about what this thing will be able to produce yet. No, I'm expecting the world from you. Make it so. God, you're like, you're like unreasonable. Yeah, thank you. I am. All right, did you chop down that tree thing yet, or do you want me to chop it down? No, I figured you could do something for once. Okay, because I rarely do things. Oh, snap. Like oh, automating snap. trees. Oh, that's right, I did, didn't I? Automate trees. I... Hey, who built the 9x9 just so people wouldn't ridicule you? Uh, Pahimar. 
That's right. I don't know where I would be without him. All right, so I have to get my jet hang glider thing and jump off your roof, don't I? I guess I'll come see your grinder thing too. So where's the grinder going to work? Like, is it going to be at the top of this tower that you have right now, or? It's just a little bit off of it, yeah. Okay. So where's all the items going to collect? Because we want to make sure we collect everything that drops. Uh, it should have the drop zone. Wow, that's a cool name. Um, that should be yeah, not gosh. too far off from where the nine by nines are. Sweet. We'll just want to make sure that, like, wherever things drop, uh, we can collect the resources. Wow, that's a long way down. Should I be up here when I'm not sure if my synclone's done yet? You have your hang glider, right? You have your hang glider, right? Yeah. Maybe I should just go check on my synclone. I'm being a little nervous right now. Like, just because I'm nervous. I don't want to... If I die without a synclone right now, it's like trouble, right? So. Yeah. We should probably make more synclones. Yeah, that's what I was going to look at next, is like what's involved in doing that. I know we need some sink shell chamber things. I know we need lappies. So I'm just going to look at that and see what's well, involved. Well, i got to come down well, anyways because I, I need to get some more water and stuff. So why don't I see about the tree okay. for you? Yeah, see, my clone's not done yet. And in fact, my leadstone energy cell's almost empty. I'm going to swap it with yours. I'll probably speed up the process too. Man, Chisel looks Man. cool. It is a cool mod, isn't it? My favorite thing to do with the hang glider is drop. Yeah, hang gliders are great. Oh, I felt so All right, far. So, I felt so far. Yeah, I don't, I don't even want to risk it. Like, I don't want to accidentally fall. My sink clone's not done yet. So sink shell storage, a little bit of obsidian and iron and glass. So that's really easy to get. And then the sink core requires nether quartz, ender pearl, and emeralds and lapis. So that's that's a little bit harder to get. I don't think we have any access to emeralds right now. Can you get those from you can get those from sieving gravel? Um, and nether quartz you can get from probably soul sand, I would think. Yeah, how do you get soul sand? Do you remember? It's like witch water or something? Yeah, witch water, which was um, water and oh I'm blanking. Oh, it was water beside mycelium. Oh, yeah, right. Okay. I don't have mycelium. Mycelium. Right. I like how you pill it up with your iron sand. Yeah, but you'll see why in a sec. Okay. Was that sand or dust? That's iron dust. Well, it doesn't okay, matter. Yeah. It's a gravity well, it block. Matter. Right. It may or may not work that way, but I'll let you find out. There's a gas just flying around in the daytime. Yeah, there's a creeper on his head. Oh, okay. Well, a torch won't break it. No. Nope. I didn't think so. I don't know how you want these dusts processed anymore. Uh, put them in the high oven. Uh, by high oven, you mean put it in the chest? Yes, that's what I did for you. Okay, what chest? One of them. Do you want me to show you where they go? They go down here. Why don't you have ducks? I will eventually. Resources are tight right now. All right, we'll be back in a minute, Pothmar. Sounds good. All right, Pothmar, so we've got automated tree cutting down things now? You're very um, eloquent. Thank you. It's my favorite thing. Ah, beautiful. Uh, so I think I'm going to start working on getting more dirt. I might even, like, get back to automating this whole dirt thing. Shouldn't be too hard to reset up. I just had an oh there's a torch back there still okay i better grab that um uh, but yeah i'm gonna go back to automating the dirt production because i want to build like a big area outside on the other side of this wall like i said that'll house basically you know all our stuff 
that sounds sound like a good plan. plan? Sounds like a plan. Um, and you're working on the mob farm. How's that coming along? Pretty good, actually. So we'll probably have that wrapped up by the end, by you know the start of next episode, maybe. I think so. Yeah. Cool. Maybe we should automate these cacti too. I think so. They're a pretty good source of water. Right here. Are they good? I mean, like the leaves we have are crazy good right now. Like I'm not even worrying about water right now with the amount of leaves we have. And the fact that we have all this water storage, like there's no way that we're going to be in trouble with water anytime soon. Unless you blow it up. Unless you blow it up. You blow it up. Ah, uh, blows up all the things. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. So for now, I think it's a good time to wrap up the episode, Pahamar, but we'll be back next time. I'm going to go uh, dig up some sand outside, assuming my sink clone is done. Yes, yeah, I'm going to go check you. on right now. I'm trying. I still don't think I've died as many times as you have. We can check that. I know. I'm trying to remember where. Uh, click here for more info. I have seven deaths total. How many do you have? Six. Oh, really? All right, so you... Ah! I just blew up. You give me such you confidence that I'm not going to be soloing the, rap of this, the rest of this map. The rest of this map. Good. That's the plan. All right, guys. So for now, Daryl20 and Pahimar wrapping up the episode. Hope you've enjoyed it. Like I said, we'll be back next time. I think now that we've got like the first bits of this stuff ready and working, um, hopefully... I think it's really good that you're sending up a mob job, Pahamar. I didn't realize that that gunpowder would be such a good source of power, but now that I'm thinking about it, yeah, that should be a really good source of power. See, this is what you get when you pair yourself up with such a handsome and intelligent human being such as myself. Such as myself. Right, that's exactly what I was thinking. You are correct, sir. See? Like, totally, totally awesome. All right, guys. I think that's pretty much the point where we have to wrap up before Pahamar gets to... <laughs> into himself. Uh, we will be back next time, like I said, and take it easy. Bye, everyone.